In a major reversal, President Trump just approved NVIDIA's sale of H200 AI chips to China. This was previously restricted for national security reasons. See, NVIDIA made chips, and the last chips that they've really been able to sell to China was the H20. The H200 is about six times more powerful than the H20, but still a lot less powerful than the Blackwell chip, which is sort of like the flagship model. And here's where this counts. See, there's sort of like two conflicting camps all surrounding these export controls, meaning what NVIDIA is allowed to sell into China and what it can't. One is basically saying for national security reasons, NVIDIA shouldn't really sell anything. We're in this like AI arms race. This is one of the most critical things. We should limit as much of the technology transfer as possible and have sort of like keep China isolated. Now, the other camp is saying, no, 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 no. If we sort of limit our sales to China, we're just encouraging China to develop their own chips and sort of like their own architecture in which to like build their competing AI world. But if actually we sell it to them, we sort of get China hooked on our product, that is actually safer for us in the long run. And what we do is we just make sure that they're always like a year or two behind in type in terms of sort of like the tech that they have access to. Now, what is sort of curious is, you know, Trump has been very hardline on China. We talk a lot on here about all the tariffs trying to hurt the Chinese economy. And yet Trump appears to be soft or at least appears to be taking a more nuanced view when it comes to the AI sales. Now, I'm not an AI chip expert nor am I a national security expert. So, I, I, you know, whether this is good or not, I have to do a little more thinking. But I do find it interesting that Trump is taking such a drastic course correction than what you would normally think. Now, some people are going to cry foul that, you know, he's just trying, you know, he's trying to give more money to his Silicon Valley ba backers, the likes of David Sachs and those guys. Um, but there could be something here, right? There is a conversation about whether to actually keep China sort of hooked on the NVIDIA architecture or cut them off and see whether they can develop their own. Anyway, it's going to be a fascinating couple of days to sort of see how all this shakes out in the media. I'm interested in what you guys are reading on this and what you guys think. As always, like and subscribe. Your margins will thank you.